Hello Vavers you're watching YouTube channel USA News Alert. Breaking. Jim Acosta busted smearing President Trump. Jim Acosta just got busted trying to smear President Trump. Sadly, we have come to expect this from the media, but we must point out the way they frame the narrative so people don't fall for it. Look, the media has a narrative and leakers and others with agendas play to this, hell Trump did for 40 years and basically own the media. How much free media did Trump get because he knew the media craved access and he had the courage to appear unscripted on live television? A lot. We are proposing an immigration plan that puts the jobs, wages, and safety of American workers first. Our proposal is pro American, pro immigrant, and pro worker, Trump said today, introducing his immigration plan that Acosta promptly mischaracterized. Thankfully, some smart reporters at Breitbart busted him. From Breitbart, CNN's chief White House correspondent Jim Acosta on Thursday misquoted a portion of President Donald Trump's immigration speech and was quickly met with a fact check by a Breitbart news reporter. Speaking in the Rose Garden, President Donald Trump unveiled immigration reform proposals aimed at increasing the quota for skilled workers. During his remarks, the president assailed some asylum seekers' abuses of the country's immigration system. Our nation has a proud history of affording protection to those fleeing government persecutions. Unfortunately, legitimate asylum seekers are being displaced by those lodging frivolous claims, he said. Acosta promptly accused the president of portraying all asylum claims as unmerited, misquoting him on social media. Trump in Rose Garden speech paints asylum seekers with broad brush accusing them of misleading immigration authorities at border. These are frivolous claims. Moments later, Briet Bart News White House correspondent Charlie Spiring replied directly to Acosta by sharing President Trump's full quote, which highlighted that legitimate asylum seekers are being displaced by those lodging frivolous claims. Acosta did not acknowledge that he had misquoted the president after Spiring's correction.